Anna Barocca starts this first style at the back. We separate the hair into three triangles, one on each side and one in the middle. We soak the two triangles at the sides from the roots to the ends with a strong copper shade and we cover with some aluminium foil. We then lower the next triangle which is left natural. We lower the next section and we divide it into three. We reserve the two side sections before moving on to applying the dye to the middle section, again working from the roots to the ends. We cover the application and we release the reserved sections which are then covered with foil for protection. We continue lowering sections and dividing them into three triangles, which are then dyed in a layered manner. This technique will prevent the sections coinciding with one another. Once we finish working the back, we apply a 5 level chocolate shade to the rest of the hair. After achieving the desired colour, we move on to cutting the hair at the back, where we have reserved the top part mid-nape. We separate a leading section in the centre. We lift it at 90 degrees and then cut it with the razor, leaving the hair shorter at the top, but again without removing too much length. We take a parallel section and we cut it in the same way, using the leading length as reference. We work towards one side in the same way, always using the length of the previous section as reference. We now work the cut towards the other side. Then we lower a layer and we work in the same fashion. We work with parallel sections moving towards one side, always using the razor to shape an uneven style. We lift the hair and use the previously cut section as reference to trim with the razor. We do the same on the other side. We carry on working in the same way until we reach the top. We work first towards one side, then towards the other.
Using the spacing scissors, we vertically trim the hair on the side very short. We shape and trim the hair with the spacing scissors to achieve a natural and uneven finish. We now work the other side in the same way. We remove much weight from the side to leave it lighter, using a comb if necessary to shape. On top we work the hair towards one side but taking care not to lift it. Now using the length at the crown as reference we cut straight across, snipping with the scissors. We comb the hair naturally and remove any thickness from the upper layers with some snips of the spacing scissors. We comb to remove any loose ends and we finger dry. We can see here the end result of this feminine style with its becoming straight finish.